when you need some chips, you got to get them quick. That's why you get them from the SAS and Quick Chips. I am branded from the SAS, the Snack Food Appreciation Society, and that's Hugh Will Mahoney. Snack Time Pally back again in 2016, and I'll tell you, the hand workers, yes, the hand workers, they got something for us today. That's right, Ida Ooh. and Nathan hand worker, the <laughs> creators of Nathan's famous hot dogs. Who knew? Also apparently have a line of snack foods. I've actually reviewed way back in the day one of the uh, crunchy french fries mm -hmm. uh, versions of these. I forget what kind it was. Some kind of cheese, I'm sure. This is the beer battered onion rings baked onion flavored snack. Baked onion flavored snack. Yes. Okay. So onion flavor. Mm -hmm. Now, right off the bat, they're trying to tell you, this ain't a real onion ring. No, this ain't no onion ring. Don't try to get that excited. No, but no, the no. part that got me on the back here, it says, in 1916, two young Polish immigrants named Nathan and Ada Handworker mm. put down their $300 life savings to open a Frankfurter and French fried stand on Coney Island, New York. Right. They called it Nathan's Famous. You tell me they just opened it up and called it Nathan's Famous. It's famous already, man. They didn't earn that designation. Nope. That's shady. Yeah. But I like Nathan's famous, so hey, you know, but I'm just saying, you know, it, shady. It worked, I guess, because there ain't no other Nathan's, <laughs> but, you know, they sponsored that eating championship. Yes, uh, they do. Black Widow. Yep, exactly. Tape and, uh, and YouTube <laughs> YouTube superstar Matt Stoney, of course. There you go. Uh, but let's take a look at these things. They, Where'd you find them? I got them at, oh, Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree? I was thinking it'd be Big Lots. Yeah, nope, I got them at Dollar Tree. I was, I was at the Chopper's Food Warehouse, and I said, hey, I'll check out Dollar Tree, because Dan's always talking about Dollar Tree. Right, right, right. Dollar Tree is good, I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I forget them. I forget yeah. them, too. Gotta remember this. Okay. Very oniony smell right off the bat. Ooh. Hello. Almost to the point of being foul. Yes, I, that's what I would say. Ooh, that is strong. Very sharp. Yes, it's got a good shot. And they're very golden brown. Yeah. They're very appealing looking, but the smell. Yeah. Oh. I guess they're similar to a Funyun or something, a puffed corn type mm. product, covered in some kind of onion seasoning. Yeah, but Funyuns don't smell like this. Uh, not quite as funky as this. It's like mm. if, a, if an onion married a uh, sabertone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it, it's getting into that realm of ass chip. Not quite as bad. Funky, though. Yeah, for sure. The whole bag at once is what really gets you. Yeah, but let's see if they uh, taste as funky as they smell. Definite onion flavor. It's not as heavy as a Funyuns onion flavor though, which is weird because the scent is so heavy. It's very powdery. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm getting. It's very much like I said, it's an onion powder on there. Mm -hmm. And then you got the delivery system underneath. I mean, uh, that one right there, that's a whole bunch of brown. If I down up, this will show up on the camera. But, yeah, the shadows I can get you to. Know, there's a whole bunch of brown there on the end. It actually does have onion puree. Really? Yeah, in here. And uh, yeast extract. Uh, that doesn't help. Molasses? Hmm. Huh, strange. Rice flour, brown sugar, uh, a whole bunch of other stuff I can't pronounce. Hmm. But yeah, I guess that's the onion flavor actually comes from onion. Yeah. That's interesting. Well, they're very crunchy. They're very powdery. Yeah. They have heavy onion flavor. Because of that powder, they're dry. Yeah, very They dry. really much soak up all the moisture in your mouth, and they leave you dry. Makes you thirsty. Makes you thirsty. Absolutely. Yes, indeed. They do do that. Um, they don't taste bad. The smell's off-putting, though. Um, they're okay. Yeah. They're not great. Not a home run by any means. But they're not bad. But I, I would go better than, I think I would go just barely better than half, because I see I could see eating these for a bit with a beer. Yeah. But other than that, you gotta have something with them. And I don't think a soda would work. A beer, very nice combo. Two thirds. Two I go two thirds. Pretty good. They're okay. Yeah, I like them okay. I mean, I think, I think they could use a little more salt, perhaps, mm -hmm. and uh, I don't know, maybe a little actual artificial flavor would help them along a little bit too, because maybe that's why they taste a little different, because there's real onion in there. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's interesting. Um, beyond that. I'd eat them for sure, and they're only a buck, so, you know. Oh, can't if, beat the price. Yeah, if I was, you know, buy, going by a Dollar Tree and had the uh, munchies or something, I'd probably pick these up again. I'm going to go ahead and give them a three-quarter thumbs up. Oh, bumping it up higher. Yep. There you go. Absolutely, absolutely. Mm. Uh, so uh, what you need to do, 
tell us if you've had these before, if you like these better than Funyuns, or even those Utz Onion Rings. Let, let us know which are your favorites. Also, uh, once you're down there making your comment, also click on the link in the description to join the SAS group on Facebook. Mm -hmm. with hundreds of the coolest people in the whole freaking world in the group. And you should be in the group, too. Why aren't you? Get to it. That's right. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BrandonRecSAS and at Heal Will Mahoney. That's right. And when you follow those tags on Twitter and Instagram at BrandonRecSAS and at Heal Will Mahoney, there's one more thing you need to do. You always need to throw down with hashtag Snack Society all day, every day for all your snacking needs. Tell us what you're snacking on and find out what we're snacking on. And when you do, get jumped into the full horseman, baby. Like, favorite, share, subscribe, and in the meantime, in between time, say hi to the hand workers. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs> Snagging in 2016. Woo!